I apologize if the music in this video has any car noises in it. Just having some lunch now. It's uh, the middle of the day break in the class and uh, pretty tired. Woke up really early this morning to edit the last video, um, but just got four more hours and then I'm headed up to the Redwoods. Class is over. Time to drive. about 11.20 and I'm really tired so I think I'm just gonna go straight to bed. Uh, nice trees though, good preview for what's to come. You think it would be insane if after waking up at 3 a.m. this morning I got up to uh, go shoot the sunrise tomorrow? No. Yes. Mm. It's early, but hopefully worth it. Just gonna drive up to Redwoods National Park. I don't think I'm too far from the entrance. Uh, kinda just drive along and see what I can find. I don't really know this area at all. Um, so, hopefully I'll find some big trees, some cool light, maybe some nice views, we'll see. Just stopped at this overlook now, and you can see the whole valley below to the west, and there's a ton of fog, some really nice layers, and it's all just about to turn pink from the sun, so I think I'm going to shoot a time lapse of that. Just an incredible landscape out here. Check out all the fog coating the valley. Super nice. Just so much cool stuff around here. It's hard to kind of pick which spot I want to shoot. Um, and couldn't really do a wide shot just because there's so many trees here in the foreground. So using the zoom and uh, just kind of pointing at those nice hills back there with the fog sort of rolling in. Um, and hopefully I'll catch the light coming down that hill and then lighting up the clouds there but uh pretty amazing up here i'm doing one second intervals on the time lapse just uh because the fog does move fairly quickly and so you don't want to have it look like it's going too fast when you stitch all those pictures together um it's nice to kind of have that sort of calm wavy motion which is what i'm going for with this So the hills are all lit up now, and I'm just waiting for the fog to catch that light. It's kind of cool, you can see the fog casting a shadow on the hillside. Um, just kind of creates a cool separation when you look through the zoom lens. I am kicking myself right now because I was basically trying to choose between two different compositions. The one I'm shooting now, back at those hills, and then the one with this part of the tree is kind of sticking out into the fog. I don't know if you can see with this camera, but there is a rainbow in the fog, and I missed it. It always seems to happen that way. I'm not crazy, right? It, it does look like there's a rainbow down there, doesn't it? Kind of in there. My time lapse is boring. I'm going to the rainbow right now. So I've set the time lapse up 200 millimeters, as zoomed in as I can get, and uh. I don't know, we'll see how it looks. Alright, I stopped the time lapse. They were, I think, okay. Um, you know, it's not, it's a super cool foggy morning and landscape, but it's not necessarily the most kind of dynamic looking scene. But still cool to get these time lapses, so this is what 
uh, both of them look like put together. There's some pretty nice fog just kind of starting to pour through the trees up here and inevitably the light will do so as well so you might get some nice kind of light beams shining through the trees and I might just drive a bit down further along the road to see if I can get in a good spot for that um, don't have a lot of gas left but should be able to make it didn't really end up finding anything and running pretty low on gas so uh, I just ended up turning around but uh, I'm probably gonna find a pull out somewhere and just stop for a nice breakfast. The forest here is just so lush. It's just like the ground is covered in feet upon feet of just green. Pretty crazy. Running very low on gas. There was a sign up there that said gas here, but there's no gas. There is an ostrich though. Hey buddy. Made it to the gas station. Just trying to figure out a spot to camp. Just so busy the last couple days, I never really had time to plan these next few days. But uh, right now I'm here in Northern California near the Redwoods. And I'm thinking of going up here to Umqua National Forest. I know there's a cool waterfall somewhere up in there and there should be some dispersed camping as well. So I guess that's the plan. pretty cool but I'm mostly just focused on getting up to Portland at this point and I know I've kind of just skipped almost everything between San Francisco and here but I have all year I can come back and explore stuff when I want to so once I get to Portland should just kind of dive right back into exploring some cool places taking some nice photos hopefully I'm gonna be up in that area Seattle Portland for a few weeks at least um, and uh, very excited for that so just gonna end this video here and I will see you in Portland <laughs> 